Hi guys, I'm Faith Nighter, and I'm here today just to tell you why I love Sunday School and why it's important to me. I first began at Summit View in the fall of 1985. My parents moved out here. I was two to help start the church. We moved further south and I came back in the fall of 2001 as a freshman at CSU. From that point on, some of you has been my church home and now I am married to Travis. We've been going on about 16 years and we have four kids. And I just wanna tell you a little bit about my journey with Sunday School. I first started serving in Sunday School my freshman year of college. I remember it was hard to wake up for me. I remember I didn't really know a lot of the kids, but it was kind of my first experience getting to interact with some of you families and see them and get to know them, which was a blessing. From there, I didn't serve real consistently, but after getting married, I was in the three and four year old classroom a lot. I found that one to be really fun. And after having kids, we've just rotated through their classrooms on a pretty consistent basis. So we've gotten to see a lot of ages and a lot of different kids. When I asked my kids what they remember about Sunday school, my son Timothy said he loved building the city of Jericho and marching around it seven days and watching it fall down and getting to crash. Our youngest son, Zach, had a hard time in Sunday school and I was really encouraged as a parent how kind and comforting the teachers were, how much they worked to make it special and fun and help him. And now he loves going to Sunday school and he can even remember some of the stories that he's learned. And it's been a real blessing to see him grow and thrive in some of you kids. I think as I've taught kids, one thing that God's really struck me with is how each child is an eternal being and is deeply loved and known by God. Often when I'm telling the Bible story, kids will be so excited to tell me something that happened in their week and I can kind of feel like, oh, that's getting in the way of what I'm teaching. But God's reminded me that that, what's going on in their lives is important and I don't want to miss that. I do want to teach the story as well, but really to care about what's happening to each of them and to see them as an individual who's very valuable and loved by God. When we've been teaching at some of you kids as well, my husband and I met Kyle and Kelly Smith for the first time on their first Sunday when they dropped off their two girls, Lily and Savannah, and we were able to interact with them and they've been dear friends ever since. And I don't think we would have met them at least for a while if we hadn't been serving in Sunday school. I really also appreciate that some of you kids is just a place where I can rub shoulders with other parents, with other adults, with other maybe grandparents or young singles that are just also seeking to glorify God and teach kids about himself and help them see him. So I just encourage you to be praying for the kids at Summit View. They are gonna have a harder walk, I think, than we've had to really apply faith and courage in a world that's becoming more hostile. I just encourage you to be praying for them to have a big view of God, to grow to be worshipers of God and have an eternal perspective. And I also just, we need people to be serving in whatever capacity and whatever bandwidth they have just to come and love these kids. We love because God first loved us. And if you are loving the kids here at some of you, you're going to be a great teacher. Whether you're single or married, a parent or a grandparent, God can use you to impact the kids here at some of you and impact their lives. So I just want to invite you to come sign up for the fall rotation and apply faith in what God has for you and the lives of the kids at some of you.